Hello guys and welcome back to another episode on the server. Is this 28 now? Hello. Let me check real quick. So, first things first, this episode is not going to be edited. You guys get the full, raw, beautiful footage. Just because I don't want to edit today. This is episode 28. How exciting. Uh, what I'm doing right now is... Is that all the... Does this make... Okay. I'm making more fireworks. That's what I'm doing right now. And I was waiting for this to be done, but that's not important right now. So I'm going to head back over to my base. Actually, I don't really have to. I'll just put this in my ender chest. But what we're going to do today is we are going to go work on the amusement park. Just because I feel like it. I'll keep these two stacks on me, and I guess I'll put my gunpowder in my extra inventory chest. Look at all these fireworks I've made so far. I think that's all I have, but that, that's a pretty good amount for basically not having uh, done much. These cows are back. I hate them. If nobody makes a proper place for these cows instead of just a fenced off area, it should look nice then they, they might have to go. But, um, yeah, we're going to go over to the amusement park. And I have a couple more ideas for things, or at least I have one more idea, which we can't do until 1.16, but with the target block, we can... Well, that's not right. Portals are all messed up. Le Wesley said something like that. Um, what? He had to have placed it here because it got rid of cobble. Right? And this is open now? I don't know what's going on. This is not something. But anyway, as I was saying, uh, the thing that I will be adding when 1.16 comes out to my... Uh, amusement park is a target practice mini game type thing with prizes potentially. Leslie's gone. Um, that's my idea. You shoot at maybe a couple of targets and you get a score if you hit them all within a certain amount of time. Oh, I could even have like the target blocks pop up in front of things randomly. Oh, that could that could be good. Um, and then if you get a high enough score, maybe you get a prize? Maybe? Who knows? Uh, I'm still not sure if... Why would someone block these off? I don't know what the point of that is, but... Anyway. Here we are at the Mesa. I don't have my, uh, nether portal hooked up, because I don't want it... To it, my, my amusement park isn't ready yet, you know? So the only people who should come here are the ones who are really going to put in the effort to fly a <laughs> hundred blocks. Daniel's Western Recreation. <laughs> oh, that's a dumb name. Uh, oh, I thought I had leaves here left over. Oh, I do. Ta-da! Um, okay, so this is what we have so far. I should chop down these trees, honestly, but I'm not going to right now. So I don't have much of a plan, honestly. Uh, I just need to record for around 20 minutes and upload it. So I guess I should figure out what I'm going to do. But, um, oh, I never finished adding in the glowstone. I could do that. Or I could start adding in just temporary, like, elytra rings out of something. Or... You know, I, I, we should do. We're gonna start just laying out the overall shape of the park. We're gonna do that with these blocks here. So, obviously, it's gonna come out here. Oh, I, I don't want to chop that down, but there's gonna be the path here that Ben started to make. Let me go ahead and get rid of this stuff. So I'm just going to, let's see, how wide is the path here going to be? It's going to be something like this. Then it's going to branch off over that away. Similarly over this away. It's going to come out this away. Um, 
and then there's going to be this kind of big area right here where it's all... You know, Ben and I were thinking, or our plan was to leave this terracotta, but I'm thinking for the pathways, maybe have it be uh, smooth stone? Maybe. Yeah. The actual smooth stone, not what people, how people used to specify stone from cobblestone, but actual smooth stone. Do I have any torches here? I thought I had some extra torches, but maybe not. I guess not. Oh, here we go. In case I need to light anything up. Uh, but instead... So yeah, I think I'm going to go with paved... Well, not paved. What am I saying? I'm going to go with smooth stone. And then... So this will be like kind of a large courtyard with... Uh, I'm going to... Oh, should I add, like, a queue for this? I was going to add, like... Okay, so there should be kind of like a... Kind of like an entrance type thing. One, two, three, four. Or like a kind of an opening section with, like, a queue coming into it. One, two, three, four. Okay, so if it's like this... One, two, three, one, two, three four. So it would be around this size. I wonder if I can get Ben to do something like that, and then, uh, that's a, not a nice number to work with, is it? Have to come in through here, and then maybe, hmm, maybe you come in over here, but the, uh, path kind of winds down this way or something. And out this away, and back like that. A meter wide path, is that going to feel a bit cramped? These will be like fence blocks or something. Fence blocks are just fences, you know what I mean. These will be fences. Um, and then you come in here, it'll have like the waiver on a lecture. Can you uh, put the lecture podiums or whatever at an angle? How do you make a... I don't know how to make one, apparently. Let me look that up real quick. Minecraft le lectern. That's what it's called. I was calling it a lecture. A lectern is made with a bookshelf and a bunch of slabs. I don't have any leather on me, otherwise I'd make that. Can it be placed at an angle? The word angle does not appear on the Wikipedia page for it, so maybe not. But anyway, that's kind of how that will be, I think. Obviously, we need something else in this courtyard. Maybe some kind of statue? I, yeah, probably a statue. So if... Let me see how wide this is. One, two, three... Or, where should I start counting from, I guess, here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen? Is that where I started counting from? Yeah, thirteen. Thirteen wide, which means that the center is... Is this the exact center? Did Ben do, do a good job? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. He did, so this is the exact center. Right here. Do, 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 do. Okay, so if we have a statue right here, is that going to look a bit... Okay, I, I'm going to chop down these trees. Because uh, that is messing with my ability to properly perceive where the path is going to be. Oh man, I don't... Actually, these are oak leaves, sure. <laughs> I'll take them. Although, I already have enough for the maze, so... Is that all of that up there? one right here. Yeah, I already have enough leaves for the maze, as far as I know. Especially with my, like, extra few. But, um, anyway. What else can we have here in this park? Is there a block, a wood block up there? No. Um, so, an elytra flying... I should write down somewhere... Or I'll put it on signs, like where everything starts while I'm mapping this out. I'll write down where, what everything is going to be and where it is. So, since the target practice is going to be kind of like a mini-game, 
Yeah, my inventory's full. Uh, since the target practice is going to be like a mini game and not a full ride per se, um, it's not going to be here at the front of the park. You don't want people to first think, oh, this is just a cheap carnival. No, no, no. You have to have the some good stuff at the front, but then you also have to have some good stuff at the back so that the people have to walk through the park to get there. Oh, and I should have a rule book that says, like, um, no fireworks allowed in the park so that people aren't just flying everywhere. They gotta experience what it's like to walk around it, you know? Is that not disappearing? Did I miss a block? Oh, there's one there. Oops. Uh, so, yeah. So, a rule... Some rules at the front of the park would be good. Um, rules at the front of the park. Then... The carnival section with some, like, carnival-type games, like the target practice, who knows what else. That will be this away, maybe? Maybe over in this section? Where was the border before? I just want to check that real quick. The border was right... That was actually pretty far. It was right around here. Okay, so I would have had all this space anyway. So yeah, I'm going to use all of this section. I'm basically going to use... Where does this mountain end if I was to f cover all of this in something? Okay. Okay, I could actually use the entire top of at least this part of the mountain. Let me see over here. How far does this go? Oh, okay, the bigger this mountain gets, the more I'm thinking. Yeah, no, okay. Cannot cover this entire mountain range, but if I kind of chop it off right here, I wonder if Ben and I could terraform this down so that this kind of runs through to over here. We probably could. So I think that's what we'll do. This mountain is going to come down. Let me just put a line of torches here with some nether rack kind of delineating the edge here but all of that over there that might become something that might be like oh maybe that'll be like a string of gift shops or i don't know some we'll we'll think of something to put over there um but all of this i'll be able to use this flat section here and then of course uh, this is going to be kind of connected right here, but uh, I was thinking of having a bridge go across here to over there, and then how big is this mountain range? If it ends right here, okay. Okay, it does end right here, so... Are we within sight of the nether portal? It's over that away somewhere. I don't want to be too close to the nether portal. Should be like right there, yeah. Okay, but if I use this whole mountain, then I think... We're good. This does connect right here. How far does this go? This... Oh, if it stops right there? It does. Okay, so we can use this whole mountain top. Sweet. So now let me get a bird's eye view of this section. Alright, so... Let me take off my shield for a second. So we have the maze here. Uh, haven't decided what's going to be over here yet. Like, maybe this will be... Okay, I think I need, like... By the way, my elytra rings is going to go across the whole park, basically. Um, oh, that means... Oh, good thing I made that creeper farm, because I'm going to have to give people some fireworks, maybe, or find some other way to get them to head back up. Well, no, I guess I can't have fireworks, because that'd make it too easy, huh? I'll, I'll find some way of doing that. But the, fi the elytra is going to go through the whole park, and... 
Man, it's already been 15 minutes, and all I've been doing is basically, like, talking about what I could do. But I think this is going to be pretty cool. Where should the elytra section start, I wonder? I feel like that's going to be a pretty big hit with everyone. Then again, not everyone has elytra. And I don't want to have to lend out elytra. Hmm... I could. If if Ben can supply a mending book, I could supply Elytra with a loan agreement saying if they break it, then they owe me or something. But, okay. So, we'll, we'll, but I think the Elytra will be a pretty big attraction. So, maybe start it over here? If I start it over here, of course this is a pretty flat area, so maybe this should be where something big goes. So I have the idea for the target practice. I have an idea for the elytra. I, I'm i going to need both a minecart ride and a boat ride. The boat ride is going to end down there, and I think that's going to be the only thing that goes off of this plateau. Um, yeah, let's see, what else could we do? So all of this is going to be a part of my empire. <laughs> How far does this go? All the way out to here. So maybe have, like, a large tower right here to climb up. I'm just going to put... This is obviously not going to be the actual <laughs> di <laughs> diameter or size of the tower, but maybe have a tower somewhere up here that they climb up to start the elytra section, and then they can start flying throughout the map. And I feel like that could be good. So along the way here, they'll have, I think I'll have a bridge cross right here, and also they can, they'll be able to walk over that way. Um, over here, Ben is going to terraform this so that, uh, so that this looks properly supported. Um, yeah. So, if this is all terraformed, he, he's going to make it look like, kind of like an arch. <laughs> Ignore all that scaffolding, but there will be an arch here, kind of supporting this and connecting right here. Uh, but I was going to have a bridge come off over there. Maybe like a two-way bridge, one coming this way, one going that way, or would that look too busy? Hmm. We could do a bridge across from there to there. Is that basically straight across? Let me see. Yes, that, that would work. From right here across, that would definitely work. Okay, we can have a bridge there. Uh, I said there. I would have a bridge here as well. I don't know how well or how easily how easy it is to do a diagonal bridge. I could do a bridge straight across here and kind of ignore this section. I don't know if that would look better or worse. But man, talking about these ideas is kind of making me excited for like what this place could look like. Over here, what are we going to have over here? I wonder actually how f if we have a boat ride start over here in kind of a man-made mountain, go down here, maybe go through like an underground river kind of thing under this mountain and end up over here, would that be a bit much? That might be. You know, I think that's over here on this corner, uh, way over here. This is where we're going to have the uh, minecart, the roller coaster start. I think that's what we're going to have. So if anyone's going to the regular Mesa, instead of going through when we have the nether portal there, they'll see uh, the minecart section here. Okay, let me let me make some signs and start writing down where I'm going to put things. But this, this is, this is going to be pretty good, I think. Ow. I have one sign. Ta-da, okay. I wonder if I should put a border of netherrack so that nobody comes and uh, claims any of this land, but right here. 
roller coaster will start here. Okay. Then I'm not sure what will go over here. It'd have to be something small. Um, it's a village over there. Maybe like a... I don't know, man. Okay, let's head over to where the elytra section is going to start. This is going to be a big amusement park. I don't know if you guys realized before this episode how, just how big the section was going to be, but... Um, Elytra rings map tower starts here. Actually, I'll say Elytra tower, and I'll call this Elytra rings uh, game starts here. Okay. Um, did I decide what was gonna go here? I don't think I did. Wow, it's already been 20 minutes. Like, usually, if I were to edit this, it'd probably be like 8 minutes into it, maybe? Of course, I've been talking more than usual, but... Uh, yeah, okay, I think we have a pretty good idea of what's going to happen here. I didn't actually do much, honestly, but... After this... After I finish recording this, I'm going to go ahead and, I think, just start lighting up all of this area that I'm claiming. It is a pretty big area, but it is also really far away from spawn, so hopefully no one minds too much, especially because it's not like I'm taking the whole mesa or anything. There's still, just to show you guys, I'll take this off again. Like, I'm not claiming this mountain. Um, so this whole mountain right here, and where the mesa ends over here, all of this is unclaimed. Down here, there's still a large section that for people to work with. And that's not to mention the new, since we started the World Border expansion, um, all that is available from there. So, all of this is available if other people were planning on either collecting terracotta or um, making a base here, maybe. This this is claimed by me, this section here. But then this mountain is unclaimed, as far as I know. I'm assuming no one else has claimed any land in the Mesa. Uh, but all of this is unclaimed. This mountain is claimed, but beyond this mountain, people can build whatever. I'm kind of hoping people don't build any bases, like, super close to mine, like on the mountains right next to mine, but like if it was over here, it wouldn't be a problem. But yeah, I think I, <laughs> I've i claimed enough space that however many rides I want to add, I'll have space for it. But yeah, um, so this plan, this video, it's fun for me to record, because now I have in my mind a good idea of where I'm going to put everything, or the ideas I have so far anyway. Um, but I didn't do any much concrete on camera, so I hope that was good for you guys. But uh, since I've been recording for 24 minutes now, I think that that is going to end this episode. So thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!